Hello friends, family, and fans, I'm Harder D, and uh, we're back playing Hogwarts Legacy. We're doing a trial, uh, I'm whooping butt, it's fantastic, and I also uh, took some Protego uh, upgrade things. I'm not sure how to do a perfect Protego, but we're going to find out, because I took some upgrades with the talents. So it's the first thing I've actually done, because I haven't actually touched anything. But uh, yeah, so there's that, uh, let's just jump in. Whoop! Alright, here we go. So, we are back in the, um, the, uh, what do you call it? The trial. I Rebellion. have a feeling I'm very close. Oh, okay. What'd that do? Okay. Anything new back here? No, no, nothing new. All right, then, I did a thingy, my bomber. Alright, so, uh, what the? Do it again, I guess. Okay, what is that doing? Boom, there we go. Okay, okay, so, either I can go through there, or I can try to go around. Um, Revelio. obviously we've got to Revelio the crap out of this place. Uh, oh, there's a chest. Wait, can I even get back up there, though? It, or, back up here is the question. I mean, I... Uh... Rebellion. Excuse me, where, where's the chest? Oh! Well, oh, that's just rude. How do I turn the portal off? How do I turn the portal off? Now I'm confused. Can I... Oh, good, I can climb back on this thing. Oh, I get it. Maybe that's what the portal does. I mean, this magic thing over here. Maybe if I leave, whoop, and then go back. It's... Eh. Wait. Wait, but the thing doesn't exist otherwise. Nothing exists otherwise. Okay. That is going to fill in that, yeah. But, what if I want to get around it? Whee! Like, you know, go through here. How do I get behind there? What is that? Incendio. I don't know. I'm kind of lost on that part. Oh! Okay. <gasps> okay, I'm seeing it. Whoop! That's a... That's a goof. Okay, so... Whoop! I'm on the other side! <laughs> there we go. And now I can just walk back through this way. And call... This bat. Uh, don't, please don't hit me. There we go. Okay, so I need that. So, I need to come down here. And, am I going to pull this through? Uh, okay. That is kind of not what I was expecting. I don't think I can... Oh! I died. Alright then. Uh, so that wasn't the answer. Why? Why did I think that was a good idea? <laughs> At least there's no, like, live. So it's all like, oh, you, you, you done goofed. So, you know. Okay. I... Hmm. Maybe... If I grab onto this now... I might... Oh, I might be able to, uh... Nope. Aha! Uh -huh. Revel in my genius! Ha <laughs> ha I have figured the thing out. Uh, 
Okay. Yes, there we go. Woo! <laughs> Okay, and dispatch. There we go. Man, I'm getting good at this. I mean, I know the whole game is designed that I do solve these, but I still feel a little accomplished, so that's my thing. I got some Wigan Weld. Oh, it's going to be like a boss fight or something. I always fear when games give me healing items just before. They're like, here's a bunch of healing items. It's like, oh no, why do I need these? All right, the better question, though, is what if I get better spells or different spells like leviosa i never use so i'm gonna use this uh accio i don't i i generally don't use uh confringo long bolt on uh, hits enemies with fire based attack that will continue to take damage for a few seconds uh what during which time collisions will result in incendiary bursts what's this then uh oh it still bursts okay um Hit enemies with fire-based attacks will continue to take damage for a few seconds. Does the same thing. Okay, never mind. Uh, Accio, uh, Dispolzo. Why would I want to eat someone is a better question. Yeah, because then they get, like, more and more out of my range, which I find very Venue. annoying. All right. Pardon me. Oh, <gasps> there's a chest. They already know how to get me. How dare they use their intelligence. No, 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 I must. There we go. Woo! More Wigan Weld. I must be dead. I'm gonna die here. What else is the solution to why they keep giving me healing? Okay. Uh-oh. Alright, guys. I got my ice spell. I got uh, disarm. I have fire. And I got yeet. Okay. Don't like the look of this. Here, have you, uh, considered this? I don't think that worked. Uh-oh. I'm good, thanks. Uh, let's see, uh, boom! And, uh, more yeet. Oh, yeah! And Protego! Uh-oh. I don't like that they use a blue floor, because blue floor generally means um, I can't see the uh, thing beneath it. Did I just blow up a whole thing? Here. Try some ice. Woo! Woo! I want some fire then. Get rid of your weapon. You don't need that. Okay, and uh, ho, 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 big boy's coming. Uh, hello. Urgh, how about some of that? Woo! Oh, that incendio did a lot. Woo! Uh, oh. Okay, Accio does nothing. Uh, what is that? What is it? Oh! Pooping ball. Oh, yeah. Oh, there we go. Hey, Rock, you want to not be in my way? Oh, I get it. Protego. Nope. That was not it. Yep. Lightning strike. Oh, yeah. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. There we go. Uh, yeet! Anything else? Yeet time! Woo, more yeet! Ha-ha! <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Ow! I don't know why, what it wants for me at that point. Because it's yellow. Maybe I have to, uh... Oh, poop. That was rude. Oh, tap G to heal. Okay, okay. Uh, Glacius. Ow. Nope, that, that failed. Okay, uh, not doing well. Not doing well. Ow. Can you stop hitting me with, like, five attacks? Oh, 
Okay, so I do have to use correct attacks against that. Okay, that's good to know. Dang it! Oh yeah! And finish him off with some strong magic! Woo! <laughs> I almost died. I almost died. What a relief. Woo! You're telling me! Okay. And it dropped nothing. Alright. Oh. Oh! Oh, hello! Giant statue man. Um I notice you are giant. Another pensive. I notice you are giant and uh statuesque. Okay, nothing over here. Can I go underneath? <gasps> oh, I can't go underneath. Come on, it's big enough. Is that Salazar? No, I don't think so. I mean, all old wizards look the same, so... Yo, know, I can't be faulted for thinking it's Salazar, because they all look the same. Okay, and nothing this way, right? Oh, I can go underneath here. Oh, okay. Cool, cool. Uh, but more importantly, where? Yeah, it is. <laughs> yeah, the chest. Boop. Unidentified. What's with all the unidentified crap? I can't use that. Or at least not right away. Perceive him's memories. Hello. Oh. Oh. I think more or less all these trials are just ways for him to have uh, ways to show off his pensive. Uh, what is that? Oh! Did I just yeet the crap out of that? It's like, goodbye! <laughs> Face in. Okay. Uh-huh. Your ability to transfigure the world around you is remarkable. Yeah, it's awesome. What is it? My father isn't getting better. I don't think he'll ever recover from the death of my brother. Aww. It is agonizing to see those we love suffer. The trout was years ago. But the pain of losing him is as deep for him now as if it had happened only yesterday. Oh. He doesn't need pretty pillars. He needs peace. Uh, have you tried Obliviate? Get rid of the memory? I could help him, Professor. You do so much for your father already. It's not enough. I want to take away his pain. Obliviate. He forgets he had a brother. It is son. tempting, I know. To use this magic that you're mastering to transfigure more than the physical world. But human emotion is a potent force unto itself. <laughs> Even the most well-meaning and competent witch cannot possibly know the consequences of irrevocably manipulating it. So I'm to watch as my father's pain destroys him. It is not your pain to take. Sounds like you need some counseling. I mean, Obliviate's a... It's not a great idea. Every year a student sees something sillier than I could ever imagine in their tea leaves. Oh, Miss Morgana. Welcome back to Hogwarts, Professor. That's going to take some getting used to. Mm. Oh, professor Rickwood? now she's a professor. I was so pleased to hear that you'd accepted the position of defense against the dark arts, Professor. Okay. Sit, sit, Isadora. Tell us about your travels. I was actually hoping that you and the others might join me at my home this evening. Oh. There's much I'd like to share with you. That would be delightful. We shall let the others know. She's going to just obliviate right. all of them. I shall see you then. Oh, not obliviate, but <laughs> obliterate. Uh-oh. Is she the bad guy? She's seeming like the bad guy. Tragic story, once good, learns oh, bad. Another memory. 
Now to find a way out of here. Yeah, what did that teach me at all? That she wanted to... <laughs> nice. That she wanted to ease her father's pain? More crystallized stone. That must be the way back to the map chamber. Oh. Enter the map chamber. Oh, fast travel too. Thank you. It's a good thing I didn't you know, keep going with my last episode. That was an extra 15 minutes. All right. Whoa, through a wall. There you go. Hello. Hi, I'm back. Oh, hello. What have we here? Why is no one surprised I that I just appeared? I'm Hogwarts, sir. And this is Professor Fig. Professor Charles Rookwood at your service. Has someone completed the first trial? I have. I have, Professor Rookwood. Uh, I've seen you before. We saw you in the pensive in Gringotts with Professor Rackham. Indeed. So, you found the port key to access Professor Rackham's vault, and you deciphered the map within the locket you found floating above that pencil. That is correct. I did. I found something that I can't identify floating above the last pensive. Ah, yes. You will find a similar artifact in each trial. Right. You must take care to keep them safe. You'll need them to complete the journey we have set forth for you. Ugh, journeys. Once you have them all, we will tell you what to do with them. Very well. Are you able to tell me anything about the next trial? Before you proceed, I would like to speak with Charles regarding the urgent situation involving the goblins. Wait, aren't you guys like... The goblins? Right beside each other? The student has seen traces of a powerful dark magic being wielded by goblin kind. They and their mentor, Professor Fig, not only encountered goblins lurking outside of San Bacar's tower, mm -hmm. They also encountered a powerful goblin in my vault at Gringotts. Hmm. I'm afraid it would be wise to halt the trials until we know more. Oh. The other guy's all like, we let's shall hurry. To you in this matter. <laughs> let's hurry. The other guy's all like, whoa, whoa, whoa. Let's hold, let's hold on to it. Now then. Wait, Professor. The name Rookwood. Do you think it's related? That there's a connection to Victor? Perhaps. But we can't be sure of its significance, if any. For now... Tell me what you saw in the pensive. All right. Before the witch from the last pensive, Isadora became a Hogwarts professor. She argued with Professor Rackham about using magic to remove pain. Hmm. Hopefully the next pensive provides more context. For now, we should learn what Ramrock knows. And I how? Will be honest, I've no idea where to start. Then why suggest Actually, it? I might know of someone. Oh. I saw Serona at the Three Broomsticks speaking to a goblin once. They seemed friendly. Oh, that's good. Well, it's worth a try. See what you can find out. Of course, don't forget... My studies. Yes, sir. Uh, yeah, sure. I'm definitely uh, not... Before you go... Yo. Uh-huh. Professor? Have you encountered swirling traces of magic in the world? Uh, Aside from those along our path. I had Not one. That I recall. Come on, I totally what did one. They? Evidence of the Keeper's efforts to manipulate the power of ancient magic during our time. If I am correct, and I usually <laughs> am, <laughs> if you, you should if be I able to so. use them to inform and enhance your own magic. Thank you, sir. I will look out for them. I actually already found one. Wait, what's this? Oh, loading screen. <laughs> oh, and I got an achievement. That's a Keeper. And not one that's designed for, uh... Oh, it's fall now. Beautiful. Oh, that looks wonderful. Oh, I'm hoping I didn't, like, lose out on anything because of season change. I mean, that would suck. If the game's all like, yeah, uh... Uh, guys, my, my cloak. Uh... My cloak? Uh, I don't, I don't think it's supposed to do that, guys. I don't think, I don't think it's supposed to do that. All right, let's uh, fix the cloak. Um, we're gonna do this, and then, so that way it's gone. There we go. And now we're gonna fix it again. Uh, change appearance to where is my cape? 
I like my cape. It's really nice. And it's a cape, so it's the only one. Like, everything else is a, like, a cloak and such. All right, let's see. Uh, Jay, since we now remember that's our mission. Oh. oh, wow, that's a lot. Okay, I still have what looks to be all of my, um... All of my, uh, what do you call it? Um... Ugh, quests. Prepare for your search for the final keeper. What the crap does that mean? I just want Alohomora! <laughs> okay, um... I hope you will come and see me about a pressing and highly confidential matter at your earliest convenience. I believe that we may be able to help each other. Wait, I think that's the doom. Please see me after class once you have completed the tasks I've set for you. Uh huh. I would like to teach you Descendo, useful for pulling objects to the ground. Not sure what the purpose of that is. <gasps> oh, look at the owl! Hello. Okay. Well, I've opened every one because I just automatically clicked the open button. All right. So if I'm correct, which J, let's check and. Uh, there we go. It is this one. Oh, wait, what's this? Speak to Serena Three Broomsticks. Uh, required to Pulso. Okay, I already know that. Beast class. Oh, I have beast class. And uh, Caretaker's L Lunar Lament. That is how we unlock Alohomora. As you can see, it rewards. We are clearly doing that. Uh, okay, locate on the map. Yeah, <laughs> finally. Uh, wait, where is it? Is this it? Yes. <gasps> but I do want to check my um, room of requirement. Why did I want to check the room of requirement? Oh, no. Let's go to my room of requirement. And and then we'll go and get our Alohomora. Because I am lockpicking everything. I don't like that this guy hangs out here. Because I feel like I own a house elf. And I don't believe in slavery. So, <laughs> Uh, I don't like that. <gasps> Can I give him a piece of cloth? Hey, uh, have you thought about ever holding, uh, a cloak? <laughs> you can't keep freeing every house elf that helps you. Well, I don't see a reason of him, uh, being stuck with me. Fertilizer, fertilizer, fertilizer. Some of this. Some of this, some of this, some of this. Some of this, some of this, some of this. Ooh. There we go. A little bit of everything. I wonder if um, if I can increase my stuff yet. Or if it does increase. Because currently I can only equip like seven things of one type. Um, so I'm wondering if I now can do more. Let's see. Uh, what's this? Uh, okay, some paintings. Cottage illustration. Okay. Gnome. All right, uh, what about other stuff? Did I... Scientific, desk of description. Wait, did I not get anything? Gothic potting table with a small pot. Oh, these are the originals. Yeah, these are the larger ones. Yeah. Seven out of seven. So, yep, yeah, nope, I did not get any more uh, usage out of them. Ugh, I hate that. I need to look up to see whether or not I can increase those numbers. Because I would definitely like some more potting plants. There we go. Alright, so now... They're forges! Cool! Alright, so now, uh, T, get rid of that. Uh, let's put, um... Sure, why not? And then, lastly, we're gonna map out of here. And we're going to head to there. The Grand Staircase. Because, like I said, I did find out that it's this um, mission that allows us to unlock Alohomora. Ooh, the puns are strong with this one. Rebellion. All right, where... Oh, something's dinging. What's dinging? Probably above me, I guess. Uh, oh, but apparently there's also a door here. Oh. Do you can't imagine how inconvenient Shut travel was up. before I invented glue powder. No one ever cares. Oh, I'm here. Oh, I already uh, unlocked it, that's why. Uh, 
Okay, let's wait. Hello, sir. Hello. Hello again, Mr. Moon. Oh, I was hoping to see you again, my young friend. Uh, Gladwin Moon, a Hogwarts caretaker, at your service. Nice to meet you. First, uh, please allow me to apologize if I seemed a bit uh, unsteady when we last met. I'm afraid I had a rather disconcerting encounter. Okay. Although I hear your visit to Hogsmeade was even more eventful. Than mine. <laughs> yes. I suppose you could call it eventful. I certainly wasn't expecting a troll attack. No, oh, of course not. Uh, um, from what I understand, the village was lucky you were there. Of course, fact, I'm amazing. My recent visit to Hogsmeade is the reason I was hoping to bump into you. I could use your help with something. As always. Do you see very that helpful. curious statue over there? It's a demigod. When That's the a demigod. From day to night. Okay. Woo! That moon just yeeted up there. Oh. Cool. Now, if you wouldn't mind humoring me for a moment, see if you can remove the moon from the statue. All right. Uh. Ooh, odd little contraptions, aren't they? It seems the statue vanishes once the moon is removed. Wait, it was that easy? Which, incidentally, can only be done at night. Makes sense. Uh, why don't you hold on to that one for now, and I'll explain more as we walk. Okie dokie. Uh, ever since that fateful day in the village, oh. those curious statues have begun appearing about the castle. Oh. A fair number have been strewn around Hogsmeade. I saw that. Someone, it seems, is trying to torment me. Yeah. <laughs> you see, that day in Hogsmeade, I turned a corner and came face to face with a boggart. Oh. Or, or shapeshifter, if you will. I know what it is. Uh, which takes the form of whatever scares you most. This one took the form of a demigod. Why are you afraid of a demigod? They're peaceful. <gasps> yes. Terrifying creature that can see the future. <laughs> what? Wholly unnerving. I encountered one when I was a lad in Korea. Terrible experience. What? Uh, those statues are demigodesses. The moons, I assume, are an uninspired play on my name. Some jackanapes use the boggart to learn my greatest fear and use it again. <laughs> nice. I have my suspicion as to the scoundrel or scoundrels responsible. Okay. It is my hope that they will slip up and reveal themselves as the statues disappear. Oh. Okay. That is why I need your help in removing the statues. Why me? A couple of reasons, <laughs> frankly. Uh, first, your daring do against those trolls in Oxmead has gained you a reputation for fearlessness. That's true. Second, as macabre and hideous as a demiguise is, most would find my fear of them unwarranted. Agreed. You, however, have seen how they affect me. I'm at my wit's end, young friend. I simply can't bring myself to go near them. <laughs> you weirdo. In fact, I know of two statues right here in the faculty tower. Okay. Perhaps you could start simply by removing them so uh, I can go about my evening duties. Uh, what's in it for me? Why would I do this? I mean, it's a job, it so... Seems all risk and no reward. Oh, rest assured, there's very little risk and... There is, in fact, Ooh. a reward. Yes? I will teach you a particularly useful spell. Go on. Uh, first, you know how to cast a disillusionment charm, correct? Of course. Mm. You'll want to do that before wandering the tower at night. Oh. Uh, next, you'll notice that the door is locked. However will you get in? Hmm. Alahamora, that's how. But what about curfew? Curfew? Oh, tosh. <laughs> I sent you a bit like me when I was your age. Oh, the school was my oyster. <laughs> and I took advantage of it. Oh, everyone loved me for it. Uh -huh. <laughs> oh, those were the days. Oh, he just keeps going uh, on and on. You'll find one statue in the prefect's bathroom okay. and the other in the hospital wing. Good luck. Oh, and thank you. Uh huh. Oh, here we go. Alohomora. Fantastic. All right. F. So, space, space, F. Right click, left click, space. Boop. Aloha Bora. By the way, all of these spell motions are actually from um, 
are actually from Hogwarts Mystery, the game. All right, and if I'm correct, I can unlock. Hello, Hamora. Nice. Uh, okay. Use Q and E and A and D to move the sparks and rotate the dials until both corresponding gears are activated to release the lock. What? Uh. What? What? Oh. Oh. Okay. Oh, so I'm just looking for it to move? Oh, oh, there it was. Yay! Did I do it? Woo! Winning! Well done! You're in! I am. Remember, Use a disillusionment charm so no one claps eyes on you. This is a restricted area of the castle, after all. Wait, why? Why is it restricted? I guess it's because it's, um... I guess because of, uh, it's for, uh, what do you call it? Uh, teachers? Okay, uh, obviously disillusionment. <laughs> Woo! And goodbye! Revelio. Of course I'm gonna reveal you the crap on this. <gasps> Everything is going to go. All right. Okay, okay. Come on. Oh, there we go. Okay, and next is. Oh, there we go. Perfect. All right, all right. I'm getting better at this. It's pretty easy, actually. You just rotate until it works. Da, 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 da. Revelio. Oh, 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 more stuff to steal. I mean, not steal. I'm not stealing. I'm, what's this? Dear Mira Mirabel, my dear Dot has been asking for you. Perhaps I can convince her to stop in for a butter here or two if you were to join us. It's been far too long. When you do manage to come by, I wonder if you'd be able to part with a few of your plants. The more fragrant ones? Ever since the troll attacks, customers have been complaining about the smell of, believe it or not, old socks. Nothing I've tried seems to cover the stench. Hoping to see you soon, with or without the plants, your friend, Ceronia. Alright. Revelio. More revelioing. Ba, 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 ba. Stealing, I mean borrowing. Totally not stealing from teachers. Nope, that's not what I'm doing. I'm gonna make up a bunch of lies to tell you I'm not stealing from teachers. Okay. Okay. Oh, oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Woo! <laughs> Professor Fig, oh my Jesus, a long one. I am in rec receipt of your most recent owl. Okay. Apologies for the delay in my response. I am still receiving a good deal of correspondence regarding the introduction of the not so secret shooting, stooging penalty in Quidge, which, in my humble opinion, has brought the game into a modern age. Astonishingly, frankly, how many spectators want nothing less than to see Quidditch keepers flattening, flattened entirely. As to the topic of your recent letter. We at the Ministry assure you that any and all pr potential threats to Wizardkind are taken quite seriously. I've made note of your concern, and as and in as much as time allows, the Department of Magical Law Enforcement will ensure that the matter is looked into uh, scheduling permitted. The value of opinions of esteemed wizards such as yourself, and you may rest assured that we have the matters well in hand. Should you wish, you can have my secretary secure seats for yourself and a guest in this year's Quidditch final. I think you would be delayed to see the results of a well-run, efficient government. Warm regards, Ferris Bavin, Minister for Magic. Okay. Avelia. I don't even know what the crap that was trying to tell me. Woo. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Super stealthy mission. Oh, that's a level two lock. Well, that's just rude. And this I require a floaty key. Why am I disillusioned if casting Revelio reveals authority figures and enemy locations, allowing you to scout ahead and remain undetected? Oh! 
I was just about to ask, why am I doing this if I don't see anyone? Okay. Oh my jeez, there's so... Reminder to staff, Hogwarts house elves do an exceptional job of keeping the castle in order. They are seldom unprepared for any number of items that they may encounter each day. However, only the other day, an unexpected stash of wizarding crackers went off from behind a cushion. The catastrophe was most un toward engulfing one poor elf in blue smoke and giving those of us near an abominable ringing in our ears for the rest of the day. I expect the culprit was Peeves. Please keep an eye out and be careful. Matilda Weasley to Epidy Hitchcock. Jeez, you guys talk too much. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I see you. Okay. That's a level two lock. Oh, she's turned right. <gasps> Can I Protificus Cototalis uh, a teacher? Nope. Probably a good idea not to as well. <laughs> I just had to stop for a snack. All right, here we go. Here we go. Hello, Amora. Okay. Uh, Come on. There it is. Okay. Oh. Oh. There we go. Oh. At least I'm getting faster at this. Wait, what? There we go. Okay. Uh, oh my, I don't want to read any more notes. Dear Abraham, you would be overjoyed to know that the local children have been taking, have taken to playing gobstones in the streets just outside your study window. They're quite charming, I must say. I noticed the youngest was without her own set of gobstones, so I lent her one of yours. I knew you wouldn't mind. I do hope things are going well at the castle. I'm relieved that you arrived safely. Dreadful sorry about the gentleman from the ministry. Uh, he was really traveling with, uh, Enelazar... And a student? Simply dreadful. Do write when you have a moment. I'm most eager to hear the stories of the year summoned court participants. Your students adore you, my dear. With love, Em. Oh, jeez. Stop talking. Pavelia. Okay. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Thank you. I'm just literally taking their money. Ooh, a rainbow. Uh, excuse me, I want this. I would totally have a little pot of gold in my, uh, in my, uh, my secret room. Okay. Uh-huh. Alright, so the key left, so I can probably go down to the key area and get that, open that box. Yep, there it is. Gonna smack this one. I'm gonna smack it good. Ugh, this is becoming another long episode, but I wanted to finish this quest Got it. before, you know, I quit. There we go. Now, I wanted to finish this quest at least, so that way I get Alohomora and access to the rest of the quest. Okay. Okay. What is the blue? Why is there a red and a blue? How are your students getting along this year? Rather poorly, I'd say. Is uh -oh. that so? We're raising a generation of coddled cape flappers that can scarcely tell the difference between Arcanite and Aspidel. Nice. Yes, well, it's still early. Still you, you say that every year, Matilda. You guys complain too much. <laughs> All right, well, obviously I can't get past them. They're literally on there. I wonder if this area is still restricted, like, after I'm done the mission. Like, that's what I'm wondering. Come on. Oh. Oh, oh no, 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 Nothing here. Nothing here. Nothing to look at. Stop looking. I totally, like, did that last two seconds. Okay, where'd he go? Where'd he Where'd he go? Oh, okay. Uh, hospital wing. This must be the prefect's bathroom. Or the prefect's bathroom. All right, here we go. Oh my jeez. 
Why is every direction that I don't go? Oh, there we go. Oh yeah. Oh, these demi guys. Oh yeah, sure. Just an entire frigid group of these things. Okay. Um. Anyway, I'm not I love that it shows them as enemies on my like. Oh, here we go. I love that it shows them as enemies. There we go. Oh. On my map. Oh. There we go. Aha! I'm figuring out how to do this faster. I'm getting better every time. Nice. Avelia. Anything else I'm missing? Oh, oh, hold on, hold on. Cut that. There we go. Field guide. The prefix bathroom features a swimming pool sized bathtub that can be filled with enchanted soap and colorful bubbles, as well as a beautiful painted mural depicting a mermaid. Yes, there she is. Oh, 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 poop, poop, poop. Uh, pardon me, guys, but okay. Okay, yep, yep, yep. Is there a distraction spell? Because why is that guy following me? Okay, hospital wing is. Up, it looks like. Uh, okay, I'm just gonna <laughs> eat myself right out of here. Oh, hello. Yes, go examine that. My students in the hospital wing on account of my venom. Yeah. <laughs> Not at the moment, no. Plenty of other perils and pitfalls to send them my way, though. Okay, okay. Well, Level two lock. Avelia. Wait, are these... Uh... Huh. I had planned to bet a few galleons on Hufflepuff this season. Hufflepuff? Well, Ravenclaw? Okay. I know when I see a window, Hogwarts uh, of uh, a hospital wait. Yeah, good for that. it. Not this year, anyway. Any, if anyone I'm has seen my stuff, they know that I am not a fan of massive amounts of reading the game wants me to do. There we go. I have officially finished the quest line. I had high hopes for Hufflepuff. I was finally going to learn the Quidditch rule. There we go. It's a majestic sport. There we go. Get out of sight. So that way the cool off goes. How's that? Can I teleport? Can I teleport? Uh, return the Debbie guys to Goldwyn. Rather a lot like life, isn't it? Oh, I suppose I should pay closer attention in the next match, if there ever is one. Uh huh. I suppose you should. There we go. Whew. All right. Like I said, another. Oh. 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 Yeah, go over there. Prefix. All right. I need to go downstairs. Don't mind me. Whoop. Uh huh. Stealthy, 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 stealthy. I love that one of the things that the game like actually advises is that you increase your stealth abilities. And I'm like, why? Like anything that I need a stealth for, I can imagine they're gonna make it easy enough. They're gonna make it easy enough that I can um. Oh, that's not what I wanted. They're gonna make it easy okay. enough. That I can um, do it without needing an upgrade. Jeweled encrusted tortoise shell. Many assume this to be a shell of the fire crab native to Fiji. However, those are known to swear it's the jeweled tortoise's shell created by a mad wizard near Versailles. Um, when his chateau was overrun by nifflers, the dazzling shell was carried off to be discovered years by a Hogwarts professor on a holiday in the Ar Ardennes. Don't know what that means. All right, almost done, guys. Almost done. Like I said, another long episode, just because I wanted to finish this quest before. Oh. Oh, there they are. Great. 
Hold on, hold on, hold on. Yes, I am going to pick... I mean, I am going to pocket this. All right, so uh, dragon. Dragon is two. So two plus three equals five, so I need nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That is what? That is the multi-head hydra. Okay. Come on. Wait. Oh, I'm looking at 14. Okay, the down one. Yes. Okay. There we go. All right, and up one, make sure no one's coming, uh, is five plus one. Wait, is that spider? Spider. Okay, so if that's nine, that's eight. Okay, so eight plus five equals, equals what? Eight plus five. Crap, I have to do math now. Uh, Thirteen. So zero. That one is demiguys. Oh, I had it at demiguys. Poop, 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 Thank you, game, for giving me such nightmares as mounting the heads of your old uh, servants. What's this guy doing? I don't know. I'm just going to yeet right out of here. There we go. Good enough. I can return to Professor Moon, and with that, I'll be able to cast Alohomora and have a barrel of fun. And whoop! Hello! Hello, Mr. Moon. I have the moons you asked me to collect. Oh, goodness! You're as fearless as that oat! An excellent start! But if we can collect more, it may shed some light on who's behind all this. Awesome! Of course, I first suspected Peeves. He drove the previous caretaker, rancorous carp, to an early retirement <laughs> nice. with his intolerable buffoonery. I know, right? Why don't they just get well, rid of that? does not explain the bogger in Oxmead, does it? No. I am determined, with your help, to discover the identity of my tormentor. Okay. Uh, I'll be glad to help. It's definitely intriguing. I'd like to help you solve this mystery. Uh, you, my friend, are a gentle person and a, a scholar. Thank you. And I have something to offer in exchange for your assistance. And what is that? Now, remember, the moons are only retrievable at night. Yeah. Thus, I encourage you to use a disillusionment when necessary. Uh-huh. How many statues are there? How many statues are there to find? I don't know precisely, but I've spotted dozens. Seems they're everywhere I look. <laughs> You have your work cut out for you, if you were to ever unravel their meaning. Uh-huh. What will I get for helping you further? You mentioned offering something in exchange for my assistance. I did. Uh, once you've brought me enough moons, I'll show you even more powerful forms of Alahamora. You say that wire. Not every lock is as easy to pick as the faculty towers. <laughs> yeah, that's for sure. All right, I'll keep looking. Understood. I shall keep an eye out. I appreciate that. All right, there we go. Oh, and I knew you were the one to ask for help. Uh, keep at it so we can solve this mystery. Fantastic. What did I get? Did I get anything good? What did I get? Did... Some experience, yes. Experience is nice. Uh, any... No materials. But, guys, there we go. We now have a Aloha more. My life is complete. I'm happy. Anyways, we're going to continue this on next time. Thank you so much for joining me. Please make sure to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, also leave me a comment so I can read that later. And until next time, you have yourself a great evening. Bye-bye.